Hi guys! I wasn't gonna vlog, but I just decided, like, right now to vlog today, or not today, I mean, I mean, hmm, words, hmm. I, it is today, but I mean, in a couple hours, I'm seeing Matt McAndrew, and he's actually opening for the Plain White Tees, but I'm going for Matt McAndrew. If you don't know who Matt McAndrew is, what are you doing with your life? I have vlogged his concert before. This will be my fifth Matt McAndrew concert, which is, like, really crazy. Sorry, I'm trying to plug my computer in while vlogging. Okay. Skills. <laughs> okay. Yeah, so I'm seeing him. I've never seen him open for someone before. He's always been the main person when I've seen him. So this will be different in that way. And I mean, it's not really a good different, I guess, but it's just different. Um, and then I'll see the Plain White Tees. I used to like the Plain White Tees when I was in, I don't know, seventh, sixth grade, many years ago. Like, four or five years ago. It'll, I don't know, like, I'm hoping I know some of their songs. I have one of their older albums on my phone. If you want to see the last vlog that I did from the Matt McAndrew concert and, like, Matt talked on the vlog and stuff, I'll link that down below. I don't know if I'm going to ask him to talk on this one. I kind of just want to, like, be in the moment, you know, but I thought it would still be fun to take you guys along. So I came home from school and I retouched, I re, what, <sighs> words today. I touched up on all my makeup. The lighting in my room is so bad. Let me try to go... Hmm. No. Let's go to my brother's room. Okay, so this is what I actually look like with good lighting. I touched up on my eyeshadow and I put contacts and I'm wearing Clinique, a Clinique lipstick. I don't really know. Now I have a couple hours. My mom isn't home yet. She better be home for the actual <laughs> concert because she's my ride. So I'm doing the VIP. I bought the VIP ticket. So I go early and then I go... And his sister comes out and, like, brings in everyone who got VIP tickets. And then we go in for, he, he does, like, a special couple songs just for VIP people. And we do a Q&A session with him. And then we get, like, pictures. And I've met him every time that I've seen him in concert. But it's never been official. It's just never been an official meet and greet. It's just been, like, a he'll come outside and meet everyone. But the last tour that he did, his summer tour, he was... I saw him both times he was headlining, like there was no one else he was doing it with, but most of his gigs, he was an opening act. He struggled to like find time to meet people, so that's why they did VIP tickets. So yeah, I'm really excited. I'm gonna edit my Halloween vlog right now because I have a couple hours and I've been trying not to think about it because I know I talked about this on my Taylor Swift vlog, but I get like concert anxiety and I talk about this on my, I've talked about this in every vlog. Like this is just like concert vlogs. I'll catch up with you guys later. When you watch your own video because you have no idea what to bring to a concert. I'm getting ready to go and I don't know what boots to wear. Let me show you my options. So the ones I wanna choose between are these boots which have heel as you can see and these boots sorry which don't but matt mcandrew's six four so i'm feeling the heels but i'm afraid they're gonna be uncomfortable and i know that these like are stylish i decided to go for the ow i decided to go for the boots with heels e okay because who am i kidding i'm a short person i'm not okay i'm not that short I'm kind of short and Matt McAndrew is very very tall and our pictures whenever I get a picture with him it always looks crazy because he's like he's a whole foot taller than me and we're off <laughs>
Um, my name's Nicole, and Lucia came to the rescue and gave me an extra meet and greet ticket. True, Matt. true, true. And I could cry. He's right, um, right there. Right. Can you see him? Yep, there he is. With his tight pants. <laughs> yeah. Anything else you want to say? Not really. Okay. Is that like. Do you like you doing? This is me trying to combine.
Oh, hey, what's up? That I do. Matt, <laughs> here for the vlog. What's up? Just signed in the phone case. My phone case. And, uh, Nicole's phone case. Not long ago. Good. good story, good story. It's all good. So here's what I got from being in the VIP. I got this... Wait. Ah, I can't pick it up. Okay. I got... You get a signed poster. It's a big poster. This is really cool because this is taken on the Schuylkill River path, which is like where I always used to go during middle school, after school, when I was with friends, we would always go to the Schuylkill River path. And that's where like this photo shoot happened because I remember when it was going on. And he said, Lucia, thanks for coming. Part Matt. And then we got these Polaroid pictures, but that lighting though, it just everything about it like, makes me look so bad. But like, whatever like you know and then these were free and they said I could take a couple so I got three and then he signed my ticket I'm kind of annoyed because I met the guy from Play My Tears I actually don't know his name is his name Pete did they no you don't know it might I feel like it might be Pete but like if I'm wrong like sorry it's really cool because I don't listen to Play My Tears now but I used to listen to them when I was little I listened to Big Bad World that album was like one of the first albums I listen to on my own like I don't when I was little I didn't have my own music taste and I didn't have my own favorite artist I just listened to what my parents listened to but that was one of the first albums that I had like on my own and I listened to it for me and like my mom what you got it for Max you didn't even get it for me <clears throat> I was the one that liked it Oh, I thought it was a gift for Max. I met the guy and I gave him a hug and I said like, I was like, you know, like you were my childhood and like when you started playing those songs from that album, like I, he said like the one song, I can't remember what it was, but they played it and I freaked out because that one particular song was like my childhood. And I like, I got a picture with him. I'll insert it right here. It's a horrible picture. Like I look horrendous. I've figured out that I can't wear this shirt to concerts anymore because the stripe it makes me look so like I am like I'm not I am I am a slim person that picture does not show it I apologize my mom was laughing at me it was really funny when I was meeting him from the you know the play my teeth guy my mom like jumps in and she's like I love you and I was like oh my god and no but it was really funny it was cute I'm not I I, I don't listen to them anymore so. It, I wasn't like, you know, when you get starstruck because you're meeting an, a person you really like. It was more of like, I felt like I was like going back in time to like a childhoodish me. And it was so cool remembering, like telling myself, like, what would your fourth grade you think? Because that was when I loved him. And so I wasn't like, I wasn't nervous to talk to him or anything because it's like now it doesn't mean that much to me but it does because it would have meant so much to me when I was younger. So it was just very cool. He was really nice. Seeing Matt oh, up course was just always like a great time. I had a really, really nice time. Oh, Lily, my cat is being cute. <laughs> I'm gonna wrap the vlog up here because I have nothing else to say right now, but uh, <laughs> but yeah, please give this vlog a thumbs up and please subscribe and I will see you guys very soon. Bye. Thumbs up from Lily.